Oh, Baker Mayfield got cut by the Carolina Panthers. This turkey was so whack that they didn't even want him to quarterback. They didn't even want him to back up. They said, maybe hold a clipboard. Maybe just sit on your butt and warm the bench up because we need some heat over there. My, 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 how the mighty feel. You know, he went to Cleveland. He was after Johnny Manziel. Where did he get these white boys who showboat and they are more closer to Vanilla Ice than they are to Eminem? Because they don't have much lyrical flow. They have a lot of dancing and shimmying, but they ain't got no real game. This dude was basically three snaps better than Johnny Manziel, basically. But it ain't mount to much in the NFL through too many picks. I think Odell Beckham Jr. one of the few times that someone's uh, family members called in and it actually worked in their favor because usually when a family member chimes in, it can look, it doesn't work out for family members when their family members call in. But his father showed videos of him throwing ODB wide, right, wide, left. ODB got a trip to the Rams. Got him a got him a chip. And right now is a sought after free agents. Baker Mayfield is holding a help wanted sign. Hoping somebody will pick him up. But we know he's a bust. This buster was overrated and threw too many picks. He spent too much time shooting commercials and not working on his game. You know, when you throw as many interceptions as you have commercials, that ain't a good look. They did everything for this white boy to blow him up. They've been wanting another gunslinging Brett Favre or Fran Tarkin or some kind of white boy that can move and appeal and all this other stuff, which has minimal to do with football, but more to do with marketing. And he had major marketing, and he's a big old bust. He could even beat Sam Donald for the job in Carolina. You know, just another clipboard holding white boy. And see, I get mad. Yeah, I take it personal. Because I think about Colin Kaepernick, I think about black quarterbacks who should have jobs. This turkey had two opportunities and stunk it up and is washed before 30 because he ain't going to start for nobody. Not nobody that same. He ain't that good. And, you know, you see Skip Bayless and people still trying to defend him and act like, well, maybe if you give, if you turn the plum, if you can squeeze, there ain't nothing to squeeze out. This buster is a flop. Okay. They gave him two chances. It didn't work. It didn't work. He don't even look worthy of being a second-tier quarterback. Third tier on a good day, and that's being kind. Please hit like, subscribe, work on thoughts, or comments, and I do respond. Share the video if you want to. And uh, I like it. I'm glad because you know what? If he was black, they would have never have made him pass a couple years. This turkey been a flop, and they know it. And it just goes to show you. You never hear Bill Polian like how they came in Lamar Jackson, well, maybe he should consider being a wide out flank, or maybe he should, you know, be like McCaffrey. Maybe he should consider this. Now, nah. B U S T goes in the middle of Baker, fake field. I'm out.